All right, so today we are going to be continuing with some pixel art, but we are going to move into creating pixel art with Google Sheets. So inside of Schoology, we're going to head over to our digital art and design folder. We will head inside the pixel art and we will click on this pixel art with Google Sheets. Everything that you need for this assignment is embedded inside of here. So everything that is blue uh, is going to be a link to something external that you will use. Uh, so you're going to click here to make a copy of the Pixel Art Google Sheet template that will open this up here. And what I've done is I've created a Google Sheet that is already 26 uh, squares wide by 26 squares tall. Make a copy of that there. And then what you're going to do is you'll watch uh, this video here. This will show you how to create that grid and to choose a image. You're going to pause this at multiple times and then follow along. So you'll be bouncing back and forth between tabs. Uh, it's going to be in your best interest to choose an images that's only going to have five to six colors in it. What I've done is I've shown you an example here and this is what I had uh, created. So you don't want to choose something too complex. It's going to make it uh, a little bit too difficult to complete. Although if you're up to the challenge, you go right ahead. Uh, this here is going to guide you through the color palette with conditional formatting. So what conditional formatting does is when you put a number in a cell, it will automatically turn that cell a number. So it's kind of like a paint by numbers. Uh, this one here, watch this through creating your own image. This one here is going to match the text and the fill colors along with removing the grid lines. Uh, at the end, what you're going to do is you'll take a screenshot of your Google Sheet with the conditional formatting window open. And what I mean by that is this. When you are creating your conditional formatting, that will show over here on the right hand side. So when you do a screenshot, I want you to not only have the image uh, inside of your grid here, but also have this open so I can see that you didn't just fill the cells with a color, but you actually have done that using conditional formatting. And then you're going to go ahead and submit your screenshot to this assignment. Uh, again, I would start with an image that's relatively simple. A lot of uh, images that you searched for yesterday you could probably use in this assignment here. And this will be an assignment that will give you a couple of days to work on it, so you'll get started uh, and you'll be completing steps one through three on Tuesday. And then uh, Wednesday will be the Ed Puzzle. And then on Thursday, you'll be finishing up this assignment with steps four through seven. If you do get done early, I've put some extension activities down here at the bottom that you can uh, try to complete, help uh, give you some other options that you can do for this pixel art with Google Sheets assignment.